So, Crispin Street. Uh, so then you've noticed the thumbnail for this video is that building there. Now today it's student accommodation, uh, which is probably it's probably <laughs> it's probably more dirtier than when it was a DOS house uh, back in Jet the Ripper's time. So many of the Jet the Ripper's victims stayed here, but the thumbnail that I've used for this video um, is lots of women queuing up exactly at that spot i just find it really surreal how you know you're going back into you, that's the exact spot when these people were literally queuing up to just for a bed for the night and some wouldn't even get a bed for a night it'd just literally be a rope to hang over which is where the expression hung over comes from uh, and that road there or that artillery lane, artillery passage probably the most Victorian in the whole of London city there's been so much filming uh, along there um, that's where they filmed The Omen in the 1970s uh, and you've, so I showed you the entrance but that was where the the men, so you've seen the sign of the door so that's where the men would queue up for a bed for the night and the women and children would go around there But I, if, if coming up here is just like going into a time zone, going back over a hundred years ago. No, the gas lamps, someone would go round on the night and light them. So them two kind of prongs on the side were where the ladders used to go. All that wouldn't have been stone, it would have been mud and straw. Back in uh, the Jack the Ripper era, that building was run by the Sisters of Mercy, who would, uh, in order to have a bed for the night, you'd have to work 12 hours a day, 14 hours a day, maybe 16 hours a day. So you can understand that a lot of these girls who weren't prostitutes would indulge in becoming a sex worker. Because you could get a, for the price of a bed, you'd have to work all day in there, where you could get the same for literally five minutes work. So that's the women's entrance, and the photo I've used in the thumbnail is literally just this spot there. It really brings it home, doesn't it, when you? When you look at it and you think, my God, 